Hello everyone, welcome back to Gitroy Tips and in this video we are going to talk about how to fix EA Sports FC24 is having error unable to save personal settings or retry or cancel or continue without saving on your PC error which is happening for many of the users right now. So how we can fix this? So let's dive into the workaround. The first one is all about we have to allow the game to window security. For what we need to do is we just need to go over here we need to add the game so let me show you just go over here in the search go for control panel now from here we have to go for uh, system and security go for uh, over here we have to go for windows defender firewall navigate to allow and app feature through windows defender firewall now scroll down and navigate to fc24 so as you can see over here you will be able to see this the fc24 is already added Make sure the private and public has to be selected. This has to be selected, which is very important. So keep in mind, if the game is not here, we can add it by default. That is, we just need to click on the change settings. Now from here, go to allow another app, go for browse, go to this PC, go to local disk C, go to program file x86, keep scrolling down, navigate to Steam, scroll down and navigate to Steam apps, go to common. Now from here, scroll down and navigate to EA Sports FC24. Now from here we have to select this one and go for open and we have to go for add. So the game is already added. That is what we have to check. The game is already added. Make sure both the private and public has to be selected. So once you add the game, we just need to try and see whether the issue is solved or not. Still, if the issue is there, we have to move to the next one. That is all about we have to delete the saved game file. For this, we just need to go over here in the file explorer. We have to go over here in this PC and we have to navigate to documents over here and now from here we have to navigate to my games and we'll be having the game here so delete the game i mean delete the uh, folder and keep in mind you'll be losing all the progressions when you do this which is very important once afterwards we just need to close this and we have to go back try launch the game next one is all about what we need to do is we just need to close the one drive so just go over here and if you find the one drive over here you will be able to find the one drive so if you find the one drive Keep in mind, if it is old, you just need to go for a uh, quit one drive. We have to go for quit one drive, which is very important. So once afterwards, try launch the game as well. Next one also, you can try a few more steps. That is all about, we have to make sure the Windows username does not have any characters, which is a very important step. So just go over here in the file explorer. Now from here, we have to go to this PC. Now go over here into local disk C and we have to go to the users. Now from here, go to the rock and make sure that you know you have to make sure that it is not having any characters if its characters are there you will be having the trouble last and the least step is all about you have to try verify integrity of game file for this we just need to go over here and right click the game click on the properties go for uh, install it file and just click on the verify integrity of game file which is going to take a little bit of time and what you need to do is once this reach 100 percentage you're going to try launch the game and that will be working fine so let this reach 100 percentage and i'll be showing you the next step what you have to do
So once all files are successfully validated, you just need to go over here and close the game and try launch the game. Most probably this is going to help you guys out. You can try these steps and that's going to help you guys out. And I hope this video is helpful. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.